Good morning, 47. The board has sanctioned Eric Soda's for termination. After Colorado, we did some digging into Soda's private affairs and discovered that he has been fast-tracked for critical heart surgery at the hyper-exclusive Gama Private Hospital in Hokkaido, Japan. Such a display of power has Providence written all over it. Soda's, who suffers from a rare condition known as situs inversus, where his internal organs are reversed, desperately needs a right-sided heart transplant and has clearly betrayed the ICA to get it. He was admitted last night and is currently being prepped for a three-day surgery. We have booked you into Gama under the usual guise of Tobias Reaper, corporate shark, here for a standard medical checkup. As such, you will need to play it by ear and procure whatever tools you need to complete the mission. You also need to eliminate Yuki Yamazaki, a Tokyo lawyer who works for Providence. Sodas has already given Yamazaki access to our client records and has agreed to provide a full list of active ICA operatives post-operation. This transaction cannot be allowed to happen. Sodas must pay for his treachery, and his insidious employers must be taught a lesson. ICA's sovereignty is at stake. Powerful as Providence may be, we need to draw a line in the sand. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Hokkaido 47. The Gama Private Hospital provides cutting-edge medical treatment for the global elite outside the law, if required. The facility is partially run by an artificial intelligence system known as Kai. The AI oversees patient admission to various areas in the hospital and even participates in some medical procedures. You will find Eric Soders in the operating theater, undergoing a pre-surgery regenerative stem cell treatment, a highly controversial procedure yet to be approved by Japanese authorities. Yuki Yamazaki has already arrived. You'll find her in her suite or roaming the restaurant and spa areas of the hospital. Sodas is scheduled to be put under soon. Let us make sure he stays that way. Good luck, 47. Hello, Mr. Reaper. As part of the service here at Gamma, Very well. That is Yuki Yamazaki, former lawyer to the Yakuza and current operative for Providence. Yes, a good situation. Miss Yamazaki is very smart, very capable. Tough as nails, too. You should see her in the court. She seems a bit, I don't know, untimely? Like she's not comfortable in her own skin? Yeah, you saw how she dropped her fags off the lift crossing the gorge. It's just nicotine cravings. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was me five years ago. Glad I got that monkey off my back. Hey, we should get her a pack. Make a good impression. In a place like this? Good luck. Uh. Yuki Yamazaki dropped her cigarettes off the lift when arriving at the hospital. According to her bodyguards, this has put her on edge. Maybe you can help quench those cravings, 47. Cigarettes are contraband at Gamma, but surely not everyone follows the rules. So the client's a trial lawyer? Criminal defense.
enjoying your stay. Maybe you can tell me, is it true the boss was connected back in the day? Kidding. Did you follow the chart on? It was everywhere on TV. Where are we? So are you doing yoga after this? Uh, I wish. Uh, as I expected. Too crowded and too little heat. Pampered weaklings with their delicate skin. How yeah, you doing? I'll pass. Maybe later. Chin up, chest out. You know, even with the added security, this is the most relaxing gig I've been on with Ms. Yamazaki yet. Nicely done, 47. When Yamazaki finds that pack, she's sure to want to light up in the first place she can find. You know, even with the added security, this is the most relaxing gig I've been on with Ms. Yamazaki yet. Mm, makes me miss the old days, to be honest. Oof, not me. I'm pretty happy she got out of the clan business. Things got hairy around that whole trial of the century thing, remember? Oh, sure. The work was dirty from time to time, but this new approach with consultant work, I don't know. It feels light. Well, I prefer light to heavy. Especially if heavy involves dissolving witnesses in acid baths before noon. Ugh. Just doesn't do it for me anymore. <laughs> that was an interesting afternoon, yeah. Mr. Jason Portman, please come to the hospital entrance. A doctor will escort you to your checkup. That was for Mr. Jason Portman. A doctor will escort you to your appointment. Please proceed to the hospital entrance.
target down. Now it's time for soldiers to retire. What's up, bud? So, you're the curator's research aide, right? Let me guess. You want to know about the medical trial? Oh, so it is true. The, the guys had a mood-altering neurochip implanted in his brain. So, so how does it work? Uh, does it work? Sorry, I'm just gonna have to wait for my research paper. I'm following the trial closely, and with a little luck, it'll be the basis for my doctorate. All I can say is... That I've got a very interesting bit of insight into his mental state. Fine. Dr. Katashi Ito, also known as the Curator, is participating in some sort of medical trial. Interesting. The Curator oversees the hospital's organ storage facility and surely has access to Soda's donor heart. I suggest you locate the Research Assistant's Report 47 and find out what this neural implant is for. Could prove useful. I'll just have to ask you again when we're drunk. Oh, my friend, it must be... Oh, my! This space! The colors! Oh, the shapes! It's beautiful! Exactly as it needs to be! Oh, a place for everything and everything in its proper place! Oh, my goodness! Oh, why haven't I noticed before? I need to share this with my babies! Bringing joy to the world now, 47. Well, let's see where this takes him, shall we? That is the right side of donor heart destined for sodas. This is what he sold out the ICA for. hope of getting a second right-sided heart in time, you have effectively killed him without laying a hand on him. This should be a clear message to anyone considering following in his footsteps. That's both targets down. 
Time to find an exit. We're done here. Miss Burnwood. That's not what my ticket says. We received your message. Loud and clear, I might add. Honestly, you could have just sacked the poor guy. I didn't catch your name. No, you didn't. There'll be no retaliation, not for Soders, nor any other recent fiascos. Someone's been meddling in our affairs, killing our operatives, and making the ICE look like fools. I think you got close to that someone, closer than we've ever been. That's why we're hiring you to take him down. I don't think so. Don't rattle our cages, Miss Burnwood. You really have no idea. You spy on us, bribe our people, and you have the gall to demand our help. No. You can't be trusted. Even so, we've been around for a long, long time. I think we could help each other. Some 20 years ago, your agency took in a young man with no past and extraordinary skills. In his own special way, he cares about you and vice versa. And ever since that time, you've never stopped wondering where he came from and who made him what he is. There was a doctor, some depraved experiment but he's gone now ah uh, well if you believe the questions died with him we have nothing further to discuss if not as I said I think we could help each other partners then Cheer up, Miss Burnwood. We, we are the lesser evil. This terrorist, he wants nothing but chaos. He's only a terrorist if you win. Miss Burnwood, we won a long time ago. This, this is maintenance.